Welcome back to my show. I'm The Beer Adventurer. And I'm Becky. And on this episode, got one from Terrapin. This is the Peach Dream Sickle IPA. Uh, I'm kind of stoked for this because a lot of things from Terrapin I like, and I'm a big peach fan. And this one could be really neat. Terrapin makes my favorite beer, though. Yeah, that's why I let you do this one with me. But I don't like IPAs. Well, but this one's going to be like a okay. fruity IPA. Well, here, then let me read that. Okay, okay. so it says, Real Peaches... And cream flavors intertwined in our Peach Dream Sickle IPA. Just a sip will have you chasing the local ice cream truck down memory lane. Okay, but well, here's the funny thing about this one. All right. So I'm looking it over, and it says the alcohol by volume, 7.89. Not 8. Not 7.9. <laughs> not 7.8. 7.89. Almost there. I know. So I picked this up at one of my favorite little beer stores in Memphis uh, at a what I considered a really good price. Um, I can already smell it. She's like, I smell peach and hop. Mm -hmm. How can I smell something so lovely as peach and then it... Ooh, look at the color. God, that looks cool. That's peach. Yeah. It pours a decent hit. I'm pouring myself more because this is an IPA. And I kind of doubt she's going to like it near as much as me. I mean, she needs a little more. She can have some. Uh... Okay. Give her a smell. I don't smell cream, but I do smell peach. I smell peach. I smell stone fruit. You've been doing this a while with me, haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> you liked that, didn't you? Yeah, I did. That was pretty cool. <laughs> okay, yeah, definitely smell that. I, I smell like... Honestly, it doesn't smell like peach candy. It smells like peaches. Like yes. a fresh peach. Yes. Um, it doesn't even smell like canned peaches. It smells no, like a fresh, fresh peach. peach. Which that's pretty good. Almost like peach pie. Like fresh peach pie. Yeah. Oh, God. Uh, that's juicy. That does not... Oh. I don't know. I haven't tried it yet. Okay, now I'm going to try. I can't stop laughing. This wasn't meant to be mean. This was meant to be nice. I thought you'd enjoy it. The initial taste is phenomenal. It's all sweet and juicy. And like, it coats your mouth. And you're like, oh, that's so great. And then, then you get all that piney and that... Oh, 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 I don't hoppy. get all the piney and hoppy. It's real juicy. I taste a lot of peach. Um, I'd, I'd say the cream is a little lacking to me. I need water. <laughs> um, it does kind of have that hot tingle. I wish this was a cream ale instead of it being an IPA. Yeah, that'd like be really Like a peach is a good. cream ale would be better. Hey, if somebody's watching this and can make that happen, that'd be pretty swell. Um... I mean, I can tell that it's an IPA, but I don't really think it says. I don't. I don't think it was quite as bad as you made it out to be. Um, Not the first IPA he's got me on today, as a matter of fact. Um, it was a devil dancer. I actually told that story. To somebody not that long ago, and I was like, and then the, this damn devil dancer woman comes out, and it's 12% IPA. They're like, oh, you like it? Oh, had no taste in my mouth for like two days. In my defense, it wasn't me that tried to get her to drink devil No, dancer. it was my best friend. And I told her not to. And she, I said, hey, wait, you may not want to. 
I think it was one of those, I'm grown, I do what I want. I, I, don't, so. I don't know. I don't know. I tried it anyway. <coughs> just, I regret but, every second of it. But back to this To one. this day. Um, I don't know. I'm kind of digging it. The aftertaste in my mouth is peach right now. Um, the, the, no. But it's Absolutely not candy not. peach. It's nope. peach peach. I get that initially. Excuse me. But that's okay. I like think I the said. color's rad. I think the flavor's rad. It has a little bit of that IPA that I do like. Uh, I don't think it's too piney. Um, it is a little more resinous, I think. Um, I think that might be what... what is throwing you off a little bit. Could be. Um, you're like, no, it's just the hops. <laughs> it's throwing you off. It's um, like a bunny hop through some and hopped in my mouth. Blah. 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 I, I, I kind of like it. Uh, it's obvious that I continue to keep drinking it. I'm going to go ahead and write for you. It's a four. <laughs> I would not grab another one. Now, if it was a uh, peaches and cream ale, maybe, but not IPA. Sorry. Well, hold on before you jump in the gun on this. Okay, I think we've kind of uh, rated it about the best that we can rate it as a team here. Now, we would love to have a discussion down there in the comments. I'm going to see what I can leave in the description about this beer. Uh, if you're enjoying this, go ahead and smash that like button. That really helps. Just like the comments do. Uh, if you'd like to see more of this, hit subscribe. Uh, I do this three times a week. Subject my friends to all kinds of issues. I really thought she'd like this more. I'd never had this. Um, unfortunately, most of my friends do not like IPAs. I gotta find somebody that likes IPAs to do this video with me too. But uh, we got big things brewing. We're having a good time. We'd love you guys to come along with us. So let's get down to my specialized review, my quantifications. Did you dig it? No. I did. No. I'm sorry. Uh-uh. Would you have another? No. Ah, I would. I like it. No. Uh, no. Does it have any secretability? No. Yeah, kind of to me. I kind of like it. There's a tangerine one, too, I saw and I didn't have. I guess you won't do that one with me. Wait. You'd rather not. Um, ladies, Steve. So, so you, once again, you're throwing lunchbox under the bus for a beer you don't want to drink. Excellent. What are friends for? Um, and a pick six, if you are an IPA fan, I can highly recommend this beer. Uh, I think it's very interesting. Uh, it has a nice flavor for an IPA. Um, uh, I'd drink a six pack of this. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't find it as bad as you did. But uh, bear in mind, if you've watched some of these videos, you will know that Becky is a porter stout. You know, she's much more of a malty. Does this beer bore you? <laughs> You're just trying to get some air in there and get rid of it. Okay. I'm trying to do anything and everything other than chewing on some, like, these wax melts that I got over here to my left <laughs> to, like, get a different flavor in my mouth. Okay. Well, we've already seen I do 1 to 10, and she gave it a 4. Um really like it i really like peach and i really like ipa i give it an eight. Oh, i, I thought the, you were gonna go seven no i think it's delicious i really like this beer good for you and i'm telling you guys right now she gave this beer a two the can one and the fact that they make her favorite beer the extra point that's how she got a four no, that would give them a five. Oh. <laughs> the beer itself is a four. Oh, okay. Yeah. And if you want to know what her favorite beer is, I'll try to leave a little card up here. Uh, she's a big fan of... Terrible. Well, which beer Chocolates. is it? Chocolates. The Moo Hoo. No, they don't make Moo Hoo. No, they don't make Moo Hoo. That was ridiculous. No, no I'm a Liquid Bliss fan yeah. myself. Mm. I, didn't mean, I didn't mean that. She's the liquid bliss. Uh, every time either one of us are out of the market and near where they sell liquid bliss, it's always buy at least a six pack. Yeah. Becky's always got a couple bucks for me if I can bring her back some liquid bliss wherever I go. So it is a great beer. I'll try to leave the link for that. All right, guys. 
Well, until your next beer adventure, looks like I get the rest of that one. Cheers. Cheers. How about it? Yay! No, 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 no.